out at Red Hat, if you look out two to three years, you top lined a lot of things. What's going to be the focus two to three years from now? Well, I, I again, I'm kind of looking at it from a, a, a holistic perspective that we need to uh, where I think things should get to um, across industry, and that's uh, that we have more you know validated pa patterns and reference architectures for imp implementing ZTA that can be shared across agencies. Like I'm a I'm a former Fed. It's some of the hardest things to do is to find out what somebody else is doing in another agency, mm. and I think we're gonna have to work towards uh, that better sharing of, of of that knowledge and information. I hope to see that. That would be like a, a hopeful scenario. We've got a clearinghouse for how we did it and how we did it well, and here's how to do it. So the so the agencies that are further ahead, like a CIS, can help some of the agencies that are a bit further behind. Um, and then, again, the vendor community working better together with open standards so that there isn't this sort of interoperability issues between solutions. I, I would hope to see that. I mean, that's certain something we push hard with community uh, uh, development approach at Red Hat. So I'd love to see that. And I do think we we touched a little bit on generative AI, but look, that's going to be a big part of what we're going to see in, in solutions uh, in the future where we're training um, on, on data that we trust, uh, that we're providing solutions that don't have, or answers that don't have a lot of randomness to them. Um, so that's kind of the difference between some of the the big models and, and and what you can see in a train model. And then the answers come back with the provenance of where the data came from. So here's your answer and here's where it came from. This is a trusted source. I think we're going to see that across a lot of different solutions um, with respect to automation. Um, and it'll become a normal thing. Like we talk about it now and in two years from now, it'll just be the the, the normal thing that, that every uh, almost every vendor has some kind of generative AI solution attached to their to their console and i, I, I think I, we're I all we're uh, certainly, everywhere we're certainly looking forward to that 